Okay. So here I will create two volumes, volume one and volume two. Okay. So I'll be have total three volume. So including my root volume. So let me create two more volumes. So go to create a volume. So I'll select ten GB space over here. Ten. Okay. So variable is on a. Then create a volume. So I will create one more volume. So create a volume. Select five GB. So total my volume will be have total fifteen GB. Okay. So I will select one so available zone that is a one. So create a volume. Successfully done. So I will just name it as this is my volume one, and this is my volume two. Okay. Uh, next, listen, listen. So next, I will attach my volume. To attach your volume, you have to select your volume one, then action, then attach volume. Running instance attach. Successfully attach my volume one. So I will select my volume two. Action, attach volume. Then select your ECT machine attach volume. Successfully done. Okay. I'll go to my virtual machine. Then I'll try to fire it out. Connect. Sudo su. So what is the command? Ls blk. And here you can. Okay. Not it. Wait, wait. It's coming. Let's refresh. So now in use, let's try. No. Where is XPDF? Mario. Okay, it's attaching. So you can see the state is attaching. It's not at attached. So let's wait. <coughs> Still, it's attaching. So we have to wait a couple of minutes until unless it's come. So let's wait a minute. On the chart. Okay, still it is attaching. Why? I'll do one thing. I will force detach and I'll do it. Attach volume. Select my instance and attach volume. Okay, so successfully attached. I will remove this first. Okay, force detach, detach. Okay, here you can see that I successfully attached two volume. So one is XVDF uh, G, another one is XVDG. Oh, sorry, H H H. Okay, fine. So now I will execute LS BLK, and you can see that XVDG and XVDH. Okay. So next I need to create a LVM. See, first we have to check whether you already installed LVM or not. Okay, logical volume management. So for that you have to execute LVM and enter. And you can see that I'm successfully installed LVM. So by default in Amazon Linux, it's already installed, pre-installed. Okay. If you not installed it, you have to execute this command. So write it down. M install LVM then star. Star in the sense all required packages. 
then space minus y auto accept write it up to install lvm lvm sorry m space install then L lvm star star in the sense all packages whatever the packages pertain to that lvm everything is going to install okay okay so done so now i will execute lvm lvm enter and you can see that now it's just getting into lvm tab right okay so now we have to execute help command over here to find all lvm commands you don't know what is the command in order then you can execute help command and you can see that these all command we can use to create lvm see config dev type and lv convert lv create see logical volume management extend we can reduce as well see if you come to lv reduce for example you have a 10 gb space and application only using 5 gb then you can reduce the space right so that's what we have a lv reduce okay so what is the helping command so first we have to getting into lvm then help command okay so next write it on first step okay first step so first step we need to create our log uh, pv right physical volume to create a physical volume write it down to create a physical volume create a physical volume step 1 to create physical volume you have to execute pv create then dev xpdf and dev xpdg and this you have to execute pv no 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 small everything is small pv create dev xpdf dev xpdg okay execute write it on pvs to list all your physical volume list all physical volume so we have physical volume and physical memory okay physical memory in the sense now physical volume that is our hard disk okay so to list all your physical volume you can execute pvs or pv scan or pv display these all are common commands Okay, either you can use either one. See, for example, PVS. That's a better one. So only uh, three letters, right? So I'll go to my virtual machine, then I will execute PVS first. Let me check whether I have any uh, LVM uh, physical volume. PVS. See now you can see that I don't have any physical volume, right? So first step is we need to create our physical volume. We can see that beneath we have a three physical volume, right? So that we have to create. To create physical volume, what is the command? PV. Okay, PV create. Dev X P X V D F. What is my uh, disk? G X P D G. Then Dev X P D. Okay, slash Dev X P D H. Right. End. And you can see that two physical volume has been created. So now I will execute again P V S. And you can see that successfully we created two physical volume. So that is. refers these three one two three so this is our physical volume i attached a physical volume then i created physical volume from that attachment okay so now i will create a volume group so when i'm creating a volume group you can see that for uh, one of my virtual ls blk okay one one minute ls blk see one of my uh, disk you can see that total 5 10 gb another one is 35 gb so when i'm creating a, a volume group Total, I'll be get how whatever it says, forty five GB I'll be get. Okay, from volume group to create a volume group, execute. Okay, write it on second command to create a volume group. VG create, VG VG creates. See so these all command are similar, so very easy to buy hard this command. Okay, see so first PV create, then you have to execute each EBS volume, then VG create, then you have to specify the VG name. So I'll specify name or VG my VG. or ashik bg aws bg you can put any name no problem so i will use bg create then my bg then you have to specify dev xpdf and dev xpdg whatever the ebs volume you have i'll go to my uh, virtual machine then i will like, execute the same bg create then i will specify name my bg my volume group so before i will execute uh, p my B, uh, bgs what is the bgs to list all volume group see as of now i don't have any volume group right or wrong wrong right right <laughs> okay yeah. okay then uh, i will execute vg create then my vg we have to specify vg name my vg then 
स्लैश्ड एक्स पी डी जी देन स्लैश्ड एक्स पी डी एच एंड and you can see that one volume group group has been created what is the name my vg, my VG. so now i will execute vg s again and here you can see that we have a one vg and we have a total two physical volume and total we have how many logical volume zero, zero logical volume what is the total space 44. 44 so now we combine two ebs volume together okay so that is the benefit of logical volume management but in by using fd partition we cannot do that okay So next, I will create a logical volume management from this uh, MI uh, volume group. Okay, so you can see the successfully created physical volume group. Then uh, sorry, physical volume. Then volume group. What is the space now? Forty-four GB. So now I will create ten uh, GB for my application, ten GB for my users, and ten GB for my others. So we can create like that. Okay, to create that, write it down. Next step. Next step. Next up, to create a logical volume management above vo volume group. To create a logical volume management above volume group. Okay, once we complete, anyone, anyone has to repeat the same. Okay. To create logical logical volume. volume group. Okay. For that, LV create. See, we have a PV create, BG yeah. create, then LV, LV, LV create. create. So I will execute LV create. What is the minus end? Huh? All the small. Everything is small. Everything is small. So what is the minus end? name name we have to specify name right so minus n so that is a name okay minus n name so i will create lv name or application you can put application others users or else my uh, occ application bangalore application you can put any name no issue so then what is the minus capital l space so you have to assign one space for that location right so i'll assign 10 gb space okay so specify minus l then your space what are the space you want Okay, so once you done that, you have to specify from which volume group you getting. So what is my volume group name? My VG. I can create multiple volume group. No problem. Okay, so I will specify slash the then my VG. Okay, and this volume group will be uh, this logical volume management will be created on top of this VG. So let me do the same. So listen, listen. I, I'm going to create a volume group. So first I will execute LVS logical volume scanning. End. You can see that I don't have any logical volume as of now. But if I execute PVS, you can see that we have a two PVS. If I execute VGS, you can see that we have one VG and total two PV on that, right? So now we will execute LV create. What is the command? Minus n. So I will create the application. So I need to specify application space. So application. Okay, fine. Water. Application. Then minus capital. What is it? Space. space okay what is the space 10 gb right so 10 g then slash do so what is my volume group name my vg okay then enter and you can see the logical volume management successfully created so now i will uh, check l v s yes. and here you can see that we have one volume volume management group what is space 10 gb so i will create one more Okay, for example, twenty GB I will create for others. Okay, so how to create? Ah, uh, lahit. LV create. Huh? Eh? Minus n. Okay then. Others. Sorry, others. Minus l. Okay, twenty gigabytes then. Slash the. Slash my VG I have to specify n. You can see that two logical volume management created. How to check? LVS, yes, you can see that one is for application, another one is for others. others. See, suppose I want to reduce this 20 GB to 15 GB, and I want to give this 5 GB to my application. How to do that? No. I want to I want to reduce this 20 GB, then I want to give 10 GB. How to do that? So write it down. LV reduce exactly. So write it down. LV reduce write it down to reduce your logical volume only management space LV reduce minus L so instead of plus one GB we have to specify minus five GB okay minus five GB then same volume management group we have to specify over here so write it down LV LV reduce LV reduce minus L then minus okay you have to put minus over here 
see when you're creating a logical volume management you don't need to specify anything see you either you can put plus or else you can skip the plus no problem but when you want to reduce you have to specify minus then only it will be applicable okay so then you have to specify the volume management group then sorry first volume group then logic logical volume management group so i'll go to my uh, virtual machine then i'll do the same so what is my logical volume management group name others see i want to reduce 5 gb from here and then okay see i want to reduce 5 gb from this 20 gb then i will yaar the irtata da okay so listen listen see i want to reduce 5 gb from this 20 gb so then i will give 5 gb to work application what is the command uh, ah nee var parna aaranu veppala pudhi aalkar pay anga engana nillya parna i want to reduce uh, lvs you can see there one is a 20 gb so here is a 10 gb so after the implementation we have to find over 15 gb over you 15 gb so what is the command reduce lv lv reduce lv reduce then minus okay minus 5g okay 5g slash the my vg volume group name so what is your logical volume management name no see ah other sorry other other sorry others end okay yes okay then i will execute lvs again and you can see that 15 gb see i reduced 5 gb and i want to add 10 gb over here. sorry 5 gb over there what i have to do lv extend no kile okay write it down write it down this command lv extend lv extend ah minus capital l then plus 1 or plus 5 we have to uh, like uh, what is the space we need to add 5 5 then we need to plus 5 over there plus 5 plus ah uh, amen sanjeev 5 gb par locate അതെ അവിടെ കിടക്കും കാണാൻ പറ്റും പറ്റില്ല നമ്മൾ ജസ്റ്റ് ഫൈവ് കൊടുത്താൽ മതി ഓട്ടോമാറ്റിക് ആയിട്ടാണ് ടെൻ കൊടുത്ത ടോട്ടൽ ആയാലും ടെന്നും ടെൻ ട്വന്റിയോ ഏയിലെ ആ അത് നമുക്ക് ചെക്ക് ചെയ്യാം ചെക്ക് ചെയ്യാൻ പറ്റും നമുക്ക് എത്ര യൂസ് ചെയ്യുന്ന ചെക്ക് ചെയ്യാൻ പറ്റും അതിന് കമാൻഡ് ഉണ്ട് പറ്റൂല അപ്പൊ നമുക്ക് എറർ വരുമോ അല്ലെങ്കിൽ നമ്മൾ ഇനി ഫോസ്ബുൾ ഡിറ്റാച്ച് ചെയ്യാം പക്ഷെ ഫയല് മിസ് ആവും ആ ബ്ലോക്ക് ഡിവൈസിൽ ഓക്കെ ലിസൺ So I am going to add 5 GB to my application. What is the command? LV, LV, LV extend. LV. Sorry, minus L. Okay, plus 5, plus 5, G, slash the, my VG, slash application. Okay, application. Okay, enter. Successfully done. So LV is. So now you can see that 15 GB, 15 GB. Okay. See if you want, if you want to enhance your uh, like capacity, again you can add one more logical volume management over here. Okay, one more disk, then you can add to logical volume group. Then again you can par divide partition by using LVM command. So quite simple. And modernly we everyone is using LVM. So most prominently. Any doubt? Doubt or not? Any doubt? No. Anyone created video? Just go through. 